So here's here's the here's the little passage that I want to kind of play side by side the lens through which maybe we can reflect on this, uh, and it's from one of your uh, favorite um, spiritual writers. It's not Pope Benedict this time. I found <laughs> I found a quote that's not Pope Benedict. Breaking new uh, ground, eh, Father? Pat? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm really branching out. Father Jacques Philippe. Oh man, I know the way the of Apple's trust and Pope. love. Okay. So here's 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 Jacques Philippe. There are weaknesses God frees us from, but others he leaves with us precisely so that we stay small and poor, dependent on his grace, compelled to keep calling out to him all the time. Blessed weaknesses that impel us to call on God. For God hears the prayer of the poor and comes to help them. Sometimes he heals our weaknesses, but sometimes he gives us the grace to live with them trustingly, to accept them peacefully, and to accept ourselves as weak and limited. That is real humility. To accept ourselves as we are, to love ourselves as we are, and it attracts God's grace very powerfully. Wow. I can't, wait to see, I can't wait to see that in the show notes so I can read it again and again. <laughs> Blessed weaknesses. Blessed weaknesses. Wow, I needed to hear that today. I won't get into detail, but just mm. <laughs> it's like the struggle. You're you just like, ah, oh, I did it again. Oh, I should have said it this way. Oh, I wasn't as attentive as I should have been. Why do I always, yeah. <laughs> you know? And I, it's, I've just had a conversation with a friend this morning, and um, I just felt like he could use this word. Man. For me, it's the, the last line that really <clears throat> just destroys me. That, <laughs> that all of that that he was just saying are blessed weaknesses. Like that's what attracts God to us very powerfully. That's yeah. what attracts his grace to us very powerfully. Like, so like when we look at this image through that lens, mm. like it, it just cha- it just changes it. Mm. Like it's, it's less of a, a call to, of course, the story of the Good Samaritan can be read through, I guess, lots of different lenses, but it's less of a call to be the guy with strength and power hoisting the, the dead and lifeless one on the animal as much yeah. as it is a recognition that I'm the dead and lifeless one yeah, and that Jesus is the one who's the good Samaritan. Mm. 